The countdown is on in Cleveland, Ohio, for the first presidential debate of 2020. Thanks for being with us here at noon, everyone. I'm Alex Backus. Joe Biden and President Donald Trump will take the stage at 6 o'clock tonight, and weeks of preparation have gone into the 90 minutes the candidates will spend on stage. Adrian Robbins now reports how the city of Cleveland plans to have a safe and secure debate. Cleveland is used to taking center stage during a presidential election, but this debate will be unlike any other. In 2016, President Donald Trump stood on stage in Cleveland, accepting the Republican nomination. I humbly and gratefully accept your nomination for the presidency of the United States. Tonight, he will once again take a Cleveland stage, this time to face Democratic challenger Joe Biden. I'm prepared to go out and make my case as to why I think he's failed. I am looking very forward to the debate. For weeks, the city of Cleveland has been preparing, transforming the Cleveland Clinic and Case Western Reserve University into a stage that will be seen by millions. Making sure that all of the systems have been checked and rechecked. The city is not only preparing for the two men of the hour, though, but the crowds and protests that will follow them. People are able to protest, they demonstrate, they're able to voice their opinion uh, with understanding that. Uh, that does not include the destruction of property or the harming of people. Though the debate itself may get heated, Ohio Governor Mike DeWine has enlisted the National Guard to keep tensions from boiling over outside the arena. Every person we interact with will be treated with the utmost dignity and respect. Coronavirus is one of six topics that will be covered, but it's also a threat that the Commission on Presidential Debates is preparing for. There will not be a handshake between the candidates or the moderator at the beginning of the debate. Once on stage, neither the candidates nor the moderator will be wearing masks. According to the Associated Press, nearly half a million people have already placed bets on the debate. You can bet on things like which topic will be brought up first, how many times will President Trump say China, and will Joe Biden wear a mask? In Cleveland, I'm Adrian Robbins. So the two candidates will debate again on October 15th and 22nd. There are just three debates planned at this point. You can watch tonight's debate, the first one, at 6 o'clock right here on Channel 8, your local election headquarters. You